There's things that people get wrong where it comes to fitness and, and most novices tend to work too hard when it's not needed. That's like you first start, you're just gonna you know, kill yourself in a sense. You're gonna try to make up for all that lost time. You're gonna punish yourself. And those same people are gonna go easy where they shouldn't. You see what I'm saying? And sometimes that is like they go easy in the nutrition department and they go hard in the exercise department. Or sometimes it's like they go hard on the exercises that make them tired versus the exercises that help them to maintain their muscle and improve their body composition in the long run. And going hard without purpose is actually very easy. Like getting tired is easy. It's, it's asking yourself like, what adaptation am I getting from this? What advantage, what change, what is the result of going hard in this manner provide for me? And the little things can matter, right? Being, being challenging yourself and all these things can matter, but they're little things for a reason, right? Adaptation, it takes time. It doesn't happen in one workout. So going hard in one workout is not the, the, the solution. It's sort of getting enough intensity in this one workout that allows you to still recover and go hard again tomorrow and the day after and the day after, as opposed to going so all out the first day that it takes you three days to recover and you really can't get your workout until two or three days later. That's like having two workouts or maybe even three workouts in the week as opposed to having like four or five. What do you think is gonna ultimately give you more results? Now. There's arguments to be made here. But the point is, if you're going too hard in these particular workouts, two or three of them, you're gonna burn out, you're not gonna get the adaptation you want. And adaptation, it takes time. There's no shortcuts, there's no hacks. So avoid that novice mistake and go hard where it counts. Maybe go hard in focusing on your nutrition and put enough intensity to, to get enough adaptation and a change and, and some sort of a result out of your physical activity, but allow enough space and enough recovery that you can come back tomorrow.